Hey guys, today I'm gonna show you how I'm doing my hand soap, homemade hand soap. So I already have my stuff prepared. First of all, I have my empty jar that I store my hand soap. I make a little bit more than my containers in the bathroom, so I store it in the clear jar. I have my Castillo soap and I buy Dr. Brunner's uh, just because it's easier to buy it. It's in every store around me, but any Castillo soap would be good. I have my aloe vera gel, which I get from Mountain Herbs because I trust that those are good quality aloe vera gel. I have my coconut oil from Costco, organic virgin coconut oil. Coconut oil is great. I have lemon essential oils. It cuts the grease off and it's great for washing off um, stuff. And I have On Guard, which is great, antiseptic, protective, boosting immune. It's just overall great doTERRA blend that I'm using in my soap. I have my little handy dandy measuring cup, cute. And I have a little um, tablespoon measuring cup. All right, so first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna measure one cup of ooh, Castillo soap. One cup of Castillo soap to the jar. This recipe is easy peasy. Half a cup of aloe vera gel. Go. Half a cup aloe vera gel. And I'm gonna add um, half a cup water. All right, so we're gonna pour that in. Oops, I probably should do it in the camera. So I'm gonna pour that in. I'm gonna add a tablespoon of coconut oil. Coconut oil has amazing skin properties. It's just great for the skin. And um, I melt mine. I could see that there were little pieces that are melted, but that's okay. I live in Texas, so mine is usually half of the time melted anyway, but I had my AC going on today so I had to um, melt a little it just takes a few seconds to melt it a little bit in the bowl on the stove and that's it now I'm gonna add my essential oils so I'm gonna add, add about 20 drops of each but both of those oils have amazing 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 properties for both cleaning cutting uh, the grease um, cleansing protecting so it's worth to have those two and I just close my jar and then shake it a little bit and voila my soap is ready so now I can go to the bathroom and fill the dispensers and I have my soap it's great it leaves a nice um, soft skin it's not harmful it's not harsh i know that some people say the castilla soap can dry up your skin but we're adding aloe vera and we're adding coconut oil i add also sometimes argan oil but i couldn't find mine so i guess i ran out and i forgot to replenish it um so this time it's just the coconut oil but the coconut oil it's amazing so it does not really need uh extra booster i just like argan oil and i like how my skin responds to it so sometimes i add it um, if I take like a spoon of uh, coconut oil, I just squirt a, little, squirt a little bit of argan oil to it, coconut oil and then just dump it together. All right, guys, so this is my soap. It has a nice milky consistency, nice color, smells amazing. I wish it, I can share the smell with you. Cleans great, um, leaves a nice skin, and it's fairly inexpensive to make. And thanks for watching.